and hello YouTube and welcome back to another episode of The Zone TV Movie Entertainment with me your host Jonathan once again bringing you another big blockbuster announcement here if you can say that on this 4th of July week so happy 4th of July to everybody out there who celebrates it here in America and thank you to all the men and women for our service for their service here thank you very much okay let's talk about this big announcement that they kind of dropped last night kind of big news I wanted to sit on it before I talked about it because I didn't know what to think about it when I first saw it I was like I don't know who this person is I don't know this person so you probably know who this person is and you're thrilled about it but apparently Disney is ready to move forward with making a live-action Little Mermaid movie so we've been hearing some rumblings you know, if you've been paying attention to social media, you know, Melissa McCarthy might play Ursula, but who's going to play Ariel? Ariel is the one who is going to be the star of the movie. So, who are they going to get? They needed somebody with the power of a good voice. They needed that. And a pretty face to go with it. So, they decided to cast um, Halle Bailey as Ariel. African American woman playing Ariel. Now, like I told you before, I don't know who she is. I never heard of her. She could be a singer for all I know. You probably yelling at me as a fan of hers, like, "Oh my God, how do you not know who she is?" Sorry, I'm not a big music guy person. I like music, but I'm not a huge like, "Oh my God, I know all these bands or, or singers or whatever." So when I heard about it, I thought about it and I thought and I thought. And I had it. I had to look her up. I really had to look her up. Not because I was worried that okay, she's a singer. She's not an actor. That's going to be a problem. But Ariel doesn't need to be an actor here. We need the one thing Ariel's good at in the Disney movie, and it's her singing voice. Does this woman can sing? I looked her up. She can sing. Check box one, which automatically overthrows anything else now i know there are a lot of people out there probably screaming at the top of their lungs to disney why isn't she a white woman well who cares for one mermaids are not real people so there's that ariel's a cartoon so get over it and three well Disney knows what they're doing. You know, they've been making movies for decades, making lots of money. That's why they've been staying at the top of the food chain for all movies in general. Even other studios can't do it. They know what the hell they're doing. But the question is going to be this. The question. Can she pull off the Dingle Hopper? That's all I'm going to say and ask. Can she pull it off? If you know the Little Mermaid movie, you know what I'm talking about. So, look, I like this casting. I don't, like I said, I don't know who she is, but she checks off the box that I needed the most as a fan of Little Mermaid. And Little Mermaid is actually not even my top five best animated movie. It's like number six top. You know, I'm sorry. You know, it's for me, it's always been Lion King, Aladdin, Beauty and the Beast. We'll reverse those two. Um, and, you know, Cinderella, obviously. Uh, you know, movies like that. Ariel has always been that bottom character. I like Sleeping Beauty a little bit more than I love Little Mermaid. But Ariel's there. It's a great character. I just... Sometimes she pisses me off as a character. I just don't never like her character. But anyway, I just think that this character needs to be represented correctly. And if they see something that us fans don't see... Well, we should trust them more than we our own opinions because honestly, we're not making the movie. We don't know what their vision is for this you know, for this version of Little Mermaid. We just have to give it a chance. And this whole nonsense that she's an African American woman doing this, who cares? Honestly, we all know that they were gonna go get some probably talented actress to do it. If I was gonna ask for, oh, what white woman do I want them to get for Ariel? I wanted Ariana Grande. I thought Ariana Grande would have been perfect for this casting. Why? Because she already had the red hair when she did Victorious and she's white. If they, if they were asking me if I wanted a white girl, get Ariana Grande. A lot of people wanted uh, Zendaya to do it. I thought that would have been great too. Give her the red hair. But like I said before, as long as she does the Dingo Hopper justice, 
It's all that matters. And having the best voice in the world, that's what they need as well. But um, but we have to just enjoy the movie when it comes up, people. So just give this lady luck. Wish her the best. Don't harass her. Don't be like, I will kill you if you don't drop out bullcrap nonsense. Don't do that to her, please. Just be grateful that we're going to get this movie because, honestly, it's going to be hard for them to make this movie without people criticizing the actress who's going to play Ariel. It's not her fault. She went in for the role. She did a testing. They liked it. it and she passed. It's like getting a job interview, you know? You don't want your worst, fr your best friend to sabotage your job it's because he doesn't want you working there. Let this woman do her job. If they wanted her as Ariel, let Disney do it because they see something that we haven't seen yet. And we have to just wait and see. It's the same thing goes, the same thing with the Robert Pattinson thing. We don't know how good of a Batman he's going to be, but we just got to give it a shot and see what Warner Bros. can come up with. Same thing with Aladdin, a lot, including myself. I didn't think Aladdin was going to be that great. I love that movie. That movie was amazing. A lot of you haters out there said that Will Smith wasn't going to be great genie, even though I said he was. And look what happened now. So let's give this woman a chance, people. That's all we need. And like I said, listen, if she fails with the, the dingo hopper, that's fine. Whatever. Then, then, then you can hate the part. But if she fails, then whatever. They'll they'll have a flop. They'll give it. A, they'll forget about Little Mermaid and do something else, and it'll be over. But at least give the person a shot before it even begins. Begin, please, because honestly, we live in a world where everybody hates each other now. It's kind of beyond pathetic, and sad, and makes us not into who are movie fans like I my, I am. Not enjoy movies as much anymore. But like I said, we gotta give this person a shot. I don't know who she is. But if she can sing, and that's the only thing that matters to Little Mermaid. That's the only thing that's going to matter. You know, that and, you know, the singing is the most important part. That's the key of the movie. You know, let's face the fact, Scuttle and Sebastian, you know, uh, Flounder, I believe. Flounder is going to be CGI anyway, so who cares about that? Ursula is going to look cool. She, she may not be the most evil villain in the movie, but you know what? We still have her in the animated movie. So let's just give it a chance, people, you know? So let's, like I said, let's, let's just give it a chance. Give this woman congratulated tweets. Please be nice to her. Like I said, we don't know who she is. If you don't know who she is, just congratulate her anyway. But like, hey, I heard you got the uh, aerial role. Congratulations. Best of luck. You know, that's it. That's all you got to do. Tweet at her all that good stuff. All the good stuff. Don't be giving her negative feedback then you're gonna put down the poor girl please and she's the right age too so she's only three years young older than she's supposed to be she's technically supposed to be a 16 year old girl but who cares she's like what 19 20 so um yeah it's gonna be fine this casting is very interesting but like i said we don't know what kind of version of little mermaid we're gonna get so we're just gonna have to wait so give me a hashtag give her a chance and Let's make that happen. So, leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think about this casting. And do you guys like it? And tell me why you like it and why you don't like it. But in a nice way, people. We don't need the racist comments continuing. Please, we don't need that. So, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you guys thought. Thank you very much and have a good day.